okay overview of the 3LM Schwitzer turbocharger project. Uh, it's about 10 years old, this stand. Um, it's got an oversized oil pump, so I've tried a bunch of other turbos. Oil cooler, ignition is a neon sign transformer. Auxiliary goes to this, it makes that blower go to this particular motor. I start with a blower. Um, this is a frequency counter. Uses an optical pickup. The circuit's on the DIY list. That's my uh, my tack. This is my EGT. Uh, oil temp. Very rarely comes up. Oil pressure. Then there we got oil filter and a bypass so I can lower the oil pressure. The fuel system right now is um, 100, 100 pound tank. Um, regulator for the uh, afterburner. Regulator for the um, turbine. Um, it runs okay on the 100 pounder. When I really want to get a lot of run time on, I'll turn the bottle upside down and take liquid out of it. For that, I have this vaporizer right here, some extra hose, uh, a couple of pumps from um, experiment with liquid fuel we're doing, a uh, smaller air jacket. Uh, this is one of the Hago bypass nozzles. This worked out really good as far as liquid fuel goes. You pump your fuel in here and then you start restricting the bypass and as you close the bypass off it forces the fuel out the nozzle but it gives an awesome spray pattern at all different fuel deliveries. It's an older just straight straight oil burner nozzle setup. We had a jet pipe without afterburner, some old flame tubes, um, some of the laser cut flanges that I use. Uh, it really helps out with this kind of stuff. Um, back to the turbine. There's my uh, EGT probe. Uh, got a little too hot a few times, unfortunately. Um, the combustor window is getting a little crazed on the inside. And the bottom of the combustor, I don't know if you can see, but the primary zone, the holes are adjustable, and that really helps tune the performance. There's that neon sign transformer. I'm only using one spark plug. The other high tension lead from the neon sign goes up to the uh, afterburner. And uh, when this afterburner gets screeching, this ceramic jack actually spins in there. I'll try to remember the video it, and this whips around. It's pretty crazy. Um, that's pretty much the uh, 3LM project. Uh, Steve Peretz owns this thing now. Uh, turbo is given to me by Ed Inbert. And it's a good running machine, and we'll get some video of it running.